Welcome to our Key Stage 3 guide on the skeletal system. In just under 3 minutes, you'll learn how your skeleton supports, protects, and moves your body, and even makes blood cells. The skeleton's main functions include supporting the body, protecting vital organs, aiding in movement, and producing blood cells. First, let's talk about protection. The skull protects your brain, which is essential for thinking and controlling muscles. The vertebrae protect your spinal cord, which carries signals from your brain to the rest of your body. The ribcage and sternum shield your heart and lungs. Your skeleton is made up of bones and joints. The femur in your thigh is the longest and strongest bone in your body, while the smallest bones, the ossicles, are in your ear. Bones are living tissues with their own blood supply. They are constantly being dissolved and reformed, and they can repair themselves when broken. Calcium is crucial for this process. Bones work with muscles and tendons to allow movement. Tendons attach muscles to bones. When skeletal muscles contract and relax, they move your bones. For example, the humerus, radius, and ulna in your arm work with your biceps and triceps to curl or extend your arm. This teamwork allows complex movements like kicking a ball or throwing a javelin. The spinal cord is surrounded by vertebrae. Most people are born with 33 vertebrae, but adults usually have 24 as some fuse together naturally. The major bones in your legs, the femur, fibula, and tibia, help you stand upright. Bones can break, but they also heal. Inside your bones is bone marrow, where blood cells are made. Red blood cells carry oxygen, and white blood cells fight infections. So remember, the skeleton supports your body, protects vital organs, helps you move, and produces blood cells. Now that you know how your skeletal system works, you can appreciate the incredible structure and function of your own body. Thanks for watching. Stay curious and keep exploring the wonders of the human body.